hello guys welcome back to our youtube channel today we bring to you just on for lauren show adiola she's an actress a producer and an entrepreneur we'll be talking about a career a background some of the school of thoughts she belongs to and uh business as well lauren show adiola was born on november 1986 from abelkota Ogun state she's also called arike gold and she said she's from a polygamous home she has six siblings she said her mom gave birth to six children three males and three females i'm the second child this does not include the other wives of her father for her educational background she attended Moshuda Biola Polytechnic at Biokuta where she studied in mass communication and thereafter she joined Balaji Amuson aka Baba Latin Theater Group in 2007. In a word she said I attended Moshuda Biola Polytechnic at Biokuta I studied mass communication and uh, thereafter I joined Balaji Amuson aka Mr. Latin Theater Group in 2007 I vividly remember the day I told my mom I wanted to become an actress. Initially, she was against it, but when I insisted, she discussed it with veteran actress Tony Adigbola. It was the latter who advised me to join a theater group close to my school so that my education would not be jeopardized. That was how I joined Mr. Latin's theater group in 2007. I graduated from the group in 2012. Apparently, the mother seems to be a friend of Tony Adigbola for her to have discussed such with the veteran actress. Her first role was in the movie called Alakba Stainless and it was produced by Mr. Latin in 2008 she said she was shy on her first day on set but she was able to overcome it since then she has taken part in several productions including Ayoni Temi, Olobo Laimo to mention but a few and she has since then featured in several other movies Alonso Adiola is not yet married but definitely in a relationship she is quite a private person and this is one of the reasons why she's not considered as one of the controversial actresses in nollywood outside acting she's a brand influencer she's an entrepreneur she has her own brand her own company where she sells turban follow jo adiola is one of the people who believe that polygamy can sort infidelity but for her she's definitely not going to marry a married man but in our opinion, it is possible for polygamy to end infidelity. When she was asked the question by the punch, she said, yes, I agree, but that does not mean I will marry a married man. Most times, ladies just want to have their own kids. Some of these ladies who are not first wives are comfortable and doing well for themselves. They are not just lucky with men. So they end up having children for married men end quote this was for Lauren Shaw at Diola explaining this and she further explained that a lot of people think she's too rich to be broke and that's not true probably because of the business that she managed and she's into gold and jewelry as well and this has made a lot of people conclude that it's not possible for Lauren Shaw Adiola aka Arika Gold to be broke in a word she said it is really funny when people think one is worth more than 100 million naira not knowing that one is still striving very hard people out there think i'm a wealthy lady some people think i'm too big to be broke my uncle once called me to buy him a car not just a car but an expensive one at that however i was not shocked at his request it was because he sees me in movies and he feels i would have made a lot of money if you're a fan and follower for lorisha adela you know she is into fashion and she loves fashion in fact she was asked the question if she was going to leave acting for fashion but she stated that acting is one thing that she loves the most she went into acting not because of the money aspect but because she loves what she does as a beautiful woman who is yet to get married she looks forward someday to become a successful actress a mom and a good wife in our words she said and i quote having made my mark as an actress my goal is to become a successful producer a wife and a good mother to my children someday that would make me a fulfilled woman so i am looking forward to that and of course as a single beautiful lady an actress for that matter she is going to get several advances from men 
and she was asked how she was able and being able to handle male fans of course she said she's able to handle them quite well in fact a fan once confessed to her that her husband really loves her in that words, she said i have had a lot of experience with fans i recall that there was a time i was in london and a woman walked up to me saying her husband loves me and my movies she said her husband always talk about me at home she then mentioned his name and added that if he ever contacts me i shouldn't respond meanwhile they were married with three kids i couldn't even say anything i was just amazed of course it's expected for the lady to have said this as most of the news that come out from nollywood industry about female actresses is usually about one person snatching another person's husband so therefore she had concluded that Fallon shadiola might be one of those ladies who is involved in such acts well she's quite private and nobody knows who she's even dating and our relationship life and speaking about the advantage and disadvantage of being an actress Fallon shadiola stated that the advantage is lesser than the disadvantage she says the disadvantage outweighs the good in our words in everything there are disadvantages and advantages being an actress has its good and bad side the opportunity we get the love and attention both home and abroad are the advantages some people also give one gift and money because they see one in movies and like one however the bad outweighs the good as actors society expects so much from us they expect us to be perfect in everything we do they fail to understand that we are also humans they go on social media and lay curses on us for no reason they abuse us and expect us not to reply because we are celebrities some also think all actresses are prostitutes as a matter of fact there are many disadvantages this was for Lonsha Adiola explaining this. But I explained that a lot of our colleagues live beyond their means. In our words, she said, the challenges most actors face is that sometimes we tend to live beyond our means to keep our image. I take all the challenges as a lesson. When you are undergoing training as an actress, you face challenges, but it depends on your level of desire and how far you want to go. Sometimes if you are going for a job and the production manager tells you that you have 10 or 15 scenes to shoot. As a lady, you have to invest in new clothes because you can't be repeating clothes on set. Lasha Adiola advice up and coming actresses saying, focus on what you do. Don't create an enmity for yourself. Don't camp in anybody's tent like seeing some as friends and others as enemies. Look for opportunities and grab them. Come to the industry with your money to earn respect. This was Adela Falon Shaw explaining this. Adela Falon Shaw is no doubt a talented and skilled actress. One who knows her craft and knows her onions pretty well in the industry. We love what she's doing and expect to see more of her on screen. Well guys, there you have it. Do not forget to like, subscribe, drop your comments in the comment section below. Thank you. Bye.